Hey everybody, it's Thomas with Get Out Arizona, and today we're going to be riding in the Estrella Mountain Regional Park located in Goodyear, Arizona. Now on tap is a short 12 mile loop that will consist of the long loop, rated as an intermediate trail, and the technical segment, which is rated as an expert trail segment. As always, these trail ratings are provided by Trail Forks. Now both of these trails are directional and that fact should be respected. Now, these two trails can be found in the far eastern portion of the park. Now for your convenience, there's two parking areas located within a half a mile of this trailhead. If you were so inclined, you could start by the horse stables, which adds approximately mm, 12 miles to your ride. But for today, we will keep it short and sweet. I'll be traveling lighter than usual, which is a welcome change. As this ride is a shorter ride, I'll be using my smaller pack. And the only thing I'll need in addition to my water and my repair kit, and my trauma kit, <laughs> are additional batteries for the GoPro, which makes carrying my larger pack a non-starter. All right, ladies and gentlemen, time is a wasting. Let's get geared up and get on trail. All right, guys, well, <laughs> I'm not about to try to bunny hop over this <laughs> pitfalls of riding in the desert, hopefully not impaling myself. Ah, poor guy. Ah. guys well fallen cactus usually aren't part of the trail last time i was here there was none but we are in the, in the deserts of arizona so it's gonna gonna happen i guess
Yeah. That's what happens when you got a unicorn on your head. <laughs> oh, son of a bitch. Oh, wow. <laughs> Hey everyone, it's Thomas once again with Get Out Arizona and it's time for the trail summary. As I stated previously, we're in the Estrella Mountain Regional Park located in Goodyear, Arizona. And today we tackled the long loop with the technical segment as an added bonus. Now Trail Forks rates these as a blue, which is intermediate, and a black diamond, which is an expert level trail. And I would tend to agree with that assessment. Don't forget, both these trails are directional and that fact should be respected. Now respectively, this is a nine mile loop and a three mile segment. And combining those will yield a total of 12 miles. However, there is some overlap on this ride and today's mileage was 14.6. Now the question is, who is this ride for? Well, if you're on the high side of intermediate like me or an advanced rider, the entirety of this ride is for you. Your skill level will primarily be put to the test on the technical segment. If you're a beginning rider, I urge you to stick with just the long loop. Though it is challenging, I feel there isn't anything that can't be overcome with a little bit of prudence at the right times. Remember, there's no shame in walking your bike through an area that you're not ready to tackle based on your skill level. This will help you avoid needless injuries. The technical loop with its narrow tracks, deep drops, and sharp turns is no place for the beginner. As you can see from the video, there's a large sign that declares, this is for experts only. And that cautionary declaration should be heeded. Seriously, guys. Though this isn't the most aggressive black diamond that I've ridden, its rating should not be taken lightly, nor any of the trail ratings for that matter. As far as an intermediate rider that may be looking to step up in a level, please proceed with caution, especially if you're riding solo. There's no room for error in the technical segment, and this is not an area you want to sustain an injury. Now, I would usually ride somewhere between 20 and 25 miles. However, I feel very content with the mileage that I've earned today. Now, later on, if I'm feeling a little froggy, a little ambitious, I might go for a short jog to offset that lack of mileage, but we'll see what tonight brings. I don't know. Ladies and gentlemen, we can't thank you enough. We know you have choices in when you choose to watch videos, and we really enjoy creating these videos for you. So if you found this video entertaining, maybe just a little bit educational, we ask that you hit the like and the subscribe button as it helps out the channel immensely. Also, don't forget to hit the ding ling ling bell notification icon. This way you'll receive notification every time we post a new video. There are some links down below to the gear that we use when we ride. Now these are not affiliate links and we do not receive any type of monetary compensation. We just put them down there for you guys so that way you know what we use give you guys a point of reference so and there you have it my friends another trail summary is in the books as a reminder even though today's assessment was from a mountain biker's perspective this is a multi-use trail and hikers will thoroughly enjoy it as well with the same precautions applying okay as always my friends we ask that you be kind to yourself and others be amazing stewards on the trail and we have to ask seriously what are you waiting for Get out Arizona. Guys, we'll see you on the next adventure.